everyone, this is Tracy and thanks so much for tuning in to my channel. Today I wanted to come to you with a video so we can see how this particular product is going to work in my hair. It's called the Lusty's Natural Argan Oil Curl Wave Twist Shaping Gel. And I had picked up this product from my local Dollar Tree and I never got a chance to really try out, I think, what it really does. But what I'm going to do is try it out today. It's kind of like hot and humid for some reason. Uh, I think it's like 90 degrees here and it feels like 100. Okay, so yes, it feels like 100. So I'm noticing how um, very frizzy my hair is just starting to get. It's getting very, very frizzy. So what I wanted to do was to go ahead and try putting this onto the ends of my hair and try hopefully that it will make it look decent, okay? Um, while I was off camera, I did do this with these ends right here. Let me see if you can see them. Now, this is how they came up. All right. So, I want, but I want to go ahead and show you guys what I'm going to do with applying this to my hair. So, what I've done is just section off each all my hair into like sections where I can it'll make it easy for me to apply the product. So, what I did I did put some, a few here. So, what I'm going to do is to start with these in the back think it'll be better and what I want to do first is by using a little moisture I'm going to just spray a little moisture onto my hair making sure my water bottle is closed okay and just dampen the hair not really get it too saturated okay then I'm going to put some oil on it in other words I'm doing I guess it would be the lock method method but this is the LOG because it's liquid oil and gel so this is the log method okay <laughs> log l-o-g so i put the the moisture on the, to the hair to seal the water that i just sprayed onto my hair in and i'm just going to get like a little bit of this gel and i'm just going to apply it right on it like this and just like smooth it on through it okay and then Go back in there with like a few I see still kind of like frizzy and just rub the gel on it as I go down. Okay, just like that. And then it's going to have to dry. So I'm hoping that it will dry um, and it'll be free. Okay, so this is how it's looking. I'm actually liking it already. Let's see. And I'm just smoothing it onto the ends of my hair, basically. I am kind of going up the shaft a little bit because the shaft of the hair was looking kind of frizzy. So I'm just rubbing it on there like this. I'm going to go ahead with this other side over here and hope that I could get into the light room. You can see me here. I'm taking this off. And what I'm going to do is split it in two. I think it came out. I think it'll come out better if I split it. Going to moisturize. Just spray a little water to it. Oil. Put a little bit of that on it. And seal it in. It's still in the moisture. And I'm going to apply the gel. Like that. That's about all I'm going to do. And I'll just let it be and let it dry. Maybe twirl some with my fingers. So you can go ahead and do what it's going to do. Move on to the move on to the next section. I'm bit, pretty bad with my elbows. Please forgive me. I'm in an awkward position. Water, oil. And gel. Okay, 
yeah, and that's all I'm going to really do. Okay. And it is starting to make my hair look a lot better. Okay, I have been trying to film this here video, but the lighting was not acting right. So now it has came back out, and I want you to at least see what these little curls look like, how they're forming, and all that good stuff. All right, so now I'm up here, this section right here. I'm just making sure I put the oil on my scalp as well. Cause my scalp was definitely in need of some some oil or something. It was kind of dry. My scalp was dry, so I oiled it. And you want to make sure you get all the way to the ends that your little ends are getting. Because those was the main things that I saw that just was just dry. Because if you don't keep your ends moisturized, that is the oldest part of your hair. You will lose it. So, and then when your hair just started looking frizzy, I said, uh, -uh I got to do something about this. And I made it quick. Okay. So, this was how it looked so far. Okay. Turn this way so you can see that side. Alright, so now I'm just going to work with this up in the front, which means I'm going to break this off into some sections here so I can work with it. If I'm in an awkward position, y'all, I'm sorry. I really am. I'm just truly sorry. I have just didn't put this together quite together good and I just was going to film this video since I had some daylight left and before it got too dark I wanted to go ahead and film this here video Put the gel because I had already put the gel on my hands first, so that way you guys can see exactly what I'm doing here. I put a little bit more that way I can put it right onto my ends because you want to make sure that your ends get the oil too. And if you guys can see them all that good. There you go. See? Yep. Because you want to make sure that they good and saturated as well. You want to make sure that they saturated, period. And if you find one that's not, just get your little gel on your hand and just go back over that shaft and twist the end at the bottom at the root. I mean, down at the bottom. And that's really it, y'all. So this is the new method, y'all. Log. L-O-G liquid which it could be any water could be water or any water based product as long as it has water in it oil which is just plain oil of any kind that you prefer and G is your gel I mean I think that's really how it goes with those wash and goes right that's really what that is liquid oil and gel I don't know too many people will really put cream on their hair but some does to each his own Liquid oil and gel. That's that's the main key ingredients, okay? And as long as you see my ends are curled up and like that, I know they're good and moisturized. That's it. Okay, I got this last little part. Definitely want to make sure you're getting it. The, the stuff on your, especially the oil on your scalp. So that's the way I'm just killing two birds with one stone. 
I'm oiling my scalp as well as moisturizing my and sealing in my ends with some type of gel to make my ends don't look so good. I thought I went like this. jumping. I hear a lot of crazy stuff about that. Alright, so this is it, y'all. This is how it looks. I'm going to get into a better light and I'll be right back so you guys can see. Okay, so I'm in a better light for now. So I wanted to step back in so you guys can see. But this is how it's looking. After applying the oil, I mean after applying water, then oil, then gel. This is it. And my ends are now refreshed and my hair is looking, I know it's got to be looking 10 times better. So let me see, can I adjust this where you guys can see? Okay. So, yeah, I kind of like that gel. It's not so hard. It kind of reminds me of the um, Hawaiian Silky Gel. Uh, let's see. What else? <laughs> it, it's a great gel. But, yeah, that's this is how my hair looks. And I'm liking it. It moisturized. This was a good idea. So, liquid oil and gel, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope that this helps some of you guys. So you have a blessed day. Bye.